thank you for joining me here on So Stitch Hex. So today, I'm just going to be doing my little thrift haul, just because I'm really excited about the things I got. So, from my local bookstore, Liberty, I got some of the witch books. There's Out of the Dark. The Light of Meridian. And Illusions and Lies. To be book six, seven, and eight. So, which I own book one, and I'm pretty sure I have two, but it's not listed in my online library, so don't know. I already owned one. Now I own two of Ever After High, The Unfairest of Them All by Shannon Hale. So I have the first one, which they're really cute. If you haven't read it or if you haven't watched the series, go do it. I'm pretty sure they still have it on Netflix. They have it's just adorable. If you haven't watched it. Alright. That was one bookstore. And that was yesterday. Starting with something from yesterday. It was a vintage website. But it got here immediately. Um, I was able to find. Oddworld. Abe's Odyssey. For PlayStation. And Oddworld. Abe's Exodus. For PlayStation. I haven't played this game. Since I was like. A baby. <laughs> Like, I had, I was little when I played this, and now I have both. I played this one yesterday. It's supposed to be my mom's favorite. Um, but I played it yesterday. I couldn't find my memory card, so today I went to the vintage game store, and I bought two used, because it's, it's fine if they're used. I got a clear purple one. I think that's pretty cool. And I got a red one for PlayStation, so I can put in my PlayStation 2 and save the game this time. Because I played through the first world where you're saving, learning all the mechanics, and you escape. Um, I played through the escape where you have to blow up dogs and stuff. Or slogs, whatever they're called. And then I played through the next portion where you are doing the sen the mimicking the sentries. And you're in the home world of the Murdochans where they originate from. And you um, basically get to go into a second world where you get to ride horses and then from there you go into another world where you interact with the crab cake looking things I think um but basically I played through a good little bit and I just couldn't save so I was just like whatever it's fine because now I can make sure to save all the production from the same store I also got a ice cube cd and a no doubt cd I love no doubt this is great so yeah, there goes that. Mm -hmm. All right, and I don't know if you see my shirt. It's Papa Legba's uh, Veve. Eh, my mom made it for me for my birthday. All right, let me see. Okay, so I went to this little thrift store that I adore. Um, it's called H and F Finds, um, and it's really cheap. It's really good. I got the girl with the dragon tattoo paperback. Women, Images, and Real Realities and Multicultural Anthology by Suzanne Kelly, Gowry, Paramess Warren, Nancy Schneidwind. Da -da -da. It's a textbook, fifth edition, but hey, it's a textbook. It was like, I think it was 25 cents. Ooh. Oh, that's so cute. And then they have like their little notes from before in this. Okay. I also got Understanding Basic Pharmacology Practical Approaches for Effective Application. If you didn't know, I love all books involving um, medicine, psychology, and this one has their notes in the book, which is fantastic. I also like. Gender studies, because I think gender is kind of stupid, but gray gender would think that. Um, I got The Queen of the Dam, Anne Rice, hardback. And then this was, I love the cover on this one. The cover is absolutely fantastic. Yeah, this was a 1988 print. You see that cover? And then on the, end, on the other side, you can tell it's an old one kind of. 
Oh, they did a great job. I love this. This is wonderful. That's my favorite of the movies, too. Okay. So I have those. Alright. I also from there got a new birdhouse. This is going to go in my room. Um, so essentially I'm going to paint it. I'm thinking of painting it a teal and painting these like pink and lavender and doing little pink flowers and little lavender flowers and maybe some little dark floral accents on the side. That's the idea. It looks like a little outhouse. <laughs> so that's it. It was $2. This was $1.50. It's a little Santa, but it's to put out your candles. Because everything was 50% off, so you see it was free, but ta-da! So, in there, I got this itty bitty witty baby. I think it's so cute, this little like, snow angel baby. I also got, this is a gift from my mom. It's a baby pig, but it's a mom, it's a mama pig, but it's so tiny. This was a little 50 cents, little unicorn, little metal. And I like that. I also got this. These are going to go on my witch hat. And she wrapped them in tissue. Oh no, the camera is slipping. Here we go. Sorry, you guys. All this fabric got in the way. So I got this. It's a new uh, flag because I'm going to be moving soon. And I'll be able to decorate in my yard. And this cute little floral. I thought it was cute. And then two little handkerchiefs that I thought I could embroider and bead on. It's super cute. Okay. So there's that. And then the last store I went to, I was able to find some really cool stuff. I got, it was two dollars, but it's a cooking pan for strawberry shortcake, which I thought was fantastic. Absolutely adore that. I also found, this was supposed to be five, but ended up being two fifty. This is absolutely adorable. You can put a candle in it or a wax mask. And it's got these little birdhouses. It's, just, it's a little cafe, but it's like a little fairy cafe. And I love it. It's adorable. <laughs> I also got cute little Christmas ornament. It's to my sledding. I got a Christmas kitty pin. This other kitty pin that I absolutely adore. It's got these danglies. It's gonna look wonderful on my witch hat. It has a little kitty. It's got a little mouse and a little butterfly. Mm -hmm. Okay, now for the best part, the books. Okay, so for books. Kind of cheesy, but I found the Atlantis, The Lost Empire, The Essential Guide from Disney. And what really sold it for me is that it's full color. And when you open it up, at the beginning it has the How to Read Atlantean. That is precious. Such a dork. <laughs> but that felt like a necessity to me. Sorry, I have mail in there. I also got Ghost Train. It's just a super cute little kid's book. It's a hologram, holographic book with like the reflector. The spooky. And I love children's books, especially spooky children's books, so I thought this was perfect. 
It's a spooky hologram book by Stephanie Wiley, illustrated by Brian Lee. Okay, so I got those. I also got Isle of the Dead by Roger Zelazin. All of their hardbacks were 50 cent and all of their paperbacks were 25 cent. Yeah, you get me. It is what it is. And this is exciting. I got book two. So I'm pretty sure I have book one because I have the one with the purple girl. But it's the Star Darlings. I got Libby in the class election. I also got Deadly Nightshade, a mystery. Cynthia Riggs. And it really caught me with the cover and the title. Uh, I like mysteries. I'm not a big fan of mysteries. Like, I like them. But that's not the book I'm going to pick. I like, I'll read them. I have several that I've read and loved. Now, this one, I'm really excited because I've been eyeing it at my local bookstore. But this was 50 cents. So, I got it at this store. Da -da -da. Mistress of the Art of Death. I'm just so excited. This looks good. The cover is what got me. Now, it does have a little water damage, but it's not damaging the letters, so for 50 cents. And the last book that I got there was Ash and Silver by Carol Berg. Which is really cute. It wasn't actually a dollar. They, this is just one of the used books. And actually, funny enough, while I was there, I noticed some of the stickers on the books that they did have indicated that they came from my usual bookstore, which I thought was kind of funny to me. It looks like y'all could have returned it to my bookstore and you get a discount when you donate books. But could have because of the type of books I saw it on. It might have been like a little old lady passing and someone just donating all her stuff. Now I'm going to open this to see what books arrived. I think it's the one. Ooh. Okay, this is not the one I thought it was. Okay, this is the Golden Bow. I ordered this one a couple days ago because I have found it for like two dollars. But it's uh, Sir James George Frazier. Yeah, one of the 20th century's most influential books. I'm excited. Yes, and I got this. So this has been my little haul. I got a bunch of junk, I know, but I'm really excited. It's all things that I love and that'll make everything super cute. All these pins will go on my witch hat and I'll be able to bake a strawberry shortcake. I adore this. This is absolutely precious. I adore short, strawberry shortcake. And then all these books were such a steal because I know that I love them and some of them have been on my list and I just didn't get them because I'm like, trying not to spend all my money on books but i did really good in um i spent less than ten dollars in two of the stores and the one i did spend like twenty dollars but i got so much stuff um that i was unbothered like it was just so much all right it's just been a fun little haul video um if you like them comment below if there's anything here that you think is extra cool um let me know I will try to do a process video of painting the little birdhouse just to do some more crafts because crafts are fun. All right. And as I read or get to the books, because they're not at the top of my list. I have a very long list and there are other books on this list. But as I get to them, you will find them eventually in their own little review. And if I get all of them done, I'll probably just put them in the description below so you can find them there. All right. Thank you guys so very much, and I hope y'all have a wonderful week. This has been my little thrift video. Ta-da! Okay. Bye! <laughs>